No matter its backstories may be, Tally truly carries the color of Blackpink. Released on September 16th, second full album Born Pink by Blackpink quickly gained positive reviews by a large number of fans in and out of the country. Among the anticipated tracks, Tally is one of the most favorite songs with a fresh air to Blackpink's discography. Through the combination of hip-hop and rock elements against the backdrop of punk-inspired guitar across the track. Currently, the song has hit 23 million streams on Spotify. In their interview with The Rolling Stone, producer and singer Soraya Lapred, one of the main composers of the track shared the behind stories for the making up the music work and revealed that the track was once forgotten for a few years after its birth. I kind of, honestly, had forgotten about the song. As a musician, as a producer, you go into the studio, you spend a lot of time, you make a lot of ideas, and sometimes these ideas come out of nowhere again. The song only crossed the New Zealand producer when songwriter Nat Dunn expressed his liking and offered to buy the song. Notably, Say So singer Adoja Cat was also in the list of recipients of the song. Before her, BB Rexa also received the track but was denied. She was trying to get that song out. She believed in it and it really showed me what it is to believe in a song and to believe in a record and to push it out because you know that people will love it, that it's an amazing idea, an amazing concept, said Soraya Lapred in expressing her gratitude for Nat Dunn when Nat discovered the song and helped deliver it the right voices. The song finally went to a Korean group thanks to Nat Dunn's strong attempt to make the song known again. However, fans cannot help but wonder how Doja Cat will perform the song after knowing about its behind stories. They also agreed that Blackpink did justice to the song and brought their own color to the track. Meanwhile, Jenny arrived at ICN International Airport today October 5, 2022, after attending the Chanel Spring Summer 2023 show at Paris. Her notable swaggy fashion was seen as she wore a Chanel Fall Winter pre-collection cardigan on a plain white shirt with black pants and a knitted cup. She can really do both. From a cute mini dress to a dope streetwear.